welcome Anthony Hudson with you. Now it's time for Sunday afternoon football. Collaborating with me in the commentary booth is Gary Lyon. Welcome, Gaz. Hey, Hanno. Today should be a good match. Today's match, Fremantle and GWS Giants. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp. And the crowd are appreciating it. The banners are ready for the players. It's a big day for the GWS Giants. Defenders, they can stop Fremantle from being dominant inside 50. They've got a big chance to win this. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp. And the crowd are appreciating it. I'm really looking forward to seeing how they play today. Of course, Hannah. The captains make their way to the center circle for the coin toss. Fremantle winning the toss. Four rounds in and there's still question marks over a couple of sides in the competition. Let's see what these two teams can bring today. You're absolutely right, Hutto. There have been some cracking games of footy so far and hopefully we have another one of those here today. We prepare for what shapes as an enthralling contest here today. Here we go. Goldstein won the duel. Ryder dug out the loose ball. Gets it out of congestion. Bo takes it well. Needs a big kick if he's going to put this through. Almost directly in front here. He takes aim. Just not good enough with that kick. Searching for a teammate. A chance to gather the ball. Ainsworth applies a bump. Collects the loose ball. Hurried kick. Gathered by Rampy. Slick with the hands. Handball finds Henderson. Begley with clean hands for a difficult bouncing ball. There'll be a ball up close to goal. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. Slips the handball to Grimes. Hits the target by hand. Has a runner alongside him. Fighting hard was Brown. Gets wrapped up. Fantastic tackle. Found a way to keep balance. Mills has resources out wide. Applying the physical pressure. Great mark under pressure. Thompson tucks it into the pocket. An easy grab for Henderson. Gets a quick kick away. Charges with intent. The umpire will ball it up. Goldstein does well. Gets on the end of this with the ball now. Begley goes for territory. Lee collects it. Duncan links with a teammate who can run. The top punt goes straight between the big sticks. Smiles all round. Fremantle get the opening goal. The umpire set the bounce to restart the game. Duncan getting in on the act. Has it now. Goldstein links up with a chance to run. Seedsman won himself a free. Just kicks it long. They chase after the loose ball. The ball spills in the tackle. Henderson applies the pressure and wins a free. Constant pressure and rewarded. Opportunity once again for Fremantle to put one through, 60 metres out. Henderson going for number one. They'll be pleased with that effort. A nice long goal. He's excited about that one. 
That's two in a row for Freeman. 13 points the difference. Thumps it clear, putting his skills on display. The Ebert with a low spearing kick. McKay doesn't take the mark. Swallow shrugs off the tackle. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Spears the ball. Interesting handball. Turned it over. Ball gets cut off. Hardigan couldn't complete the tackle. Duray was taken high in the tackle. Uses it now. Finds a target. Hartlett has resources out wide. Packing it out of there. Steady hands there as he holds that one. Buzzer channels a long kick. Hits him hard. Handballs out into space. Well picked up. Chips towards a teammate. Marks in a bit of space. Duray kicks it. Gathers it now. Umpire calls for the ball. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? It's a really good contest out there right now, and it's great to watch. Eber breaks the tackle. Quick handball. Dumont ran it best. Sends it clear of the contest. Hartlett flew high, but didn't hold on. Ball up in the centre square. Goldstein guides it down. Manages to get past. Gives a don't argue. Smooth releases it under pressure. Henderson presents and takes the mark. Might be too far out to score. A low stabbing kick. Takes an uncontested mark. Not sure if he has the journey from here. Going for goal number one. And pumps it through the big sticks. He's absolutely loving it. Why not? They are starting to stamp their dominance on this game. Look at him. He really enjoyed that one. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. It's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement. We're back in motion. Guides it down. He's got the footy in his hands. Finds the loose ball. McIntosh hacking it out of there. Henderson wins the ball in the air. 40 metres from home. Drives it towards goal. He was celebrating that goal the moment it left his boot. He's enjoying every second of it out there. This kick stretches the lead. Look at them celebrate that effort. Tap came from Goldstein. Handball's out in front. Contests the hard ball. Stringer gets in the way. Collected by Matera. Majacek going for number one. And the chance at goal is taken by GWS Giants. Gets him a reward for his efforts. GWS Giants slot their first goal. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. The the a great bit of play that resulted in that goal. Back in the middle now. Goldstein hurls it away. Smith picks it up. Scoops up the ball. Couldn't complete the mark. Saad wants to keep it moving by hand. The ball mopped up. Picks up the loose ball. They can create from this quickly onto the boot. Drops the ball. Just landed in his back. It's a long kick. Does well to cut off the kick. 
Mills has resources out wide. Easily takes the mark. Well, it's going to be penalised here. Kelly finds a way to hang on. Slams it on the boot. Gary, how did you see that opening quarter? Fremantle could have to be happy with that first turn. What do you make of it all, Gaz? GWS Giants just can't seem to retain possession of the footy. They're getting outmarked all over the ground and as a result find themselves losing this contest. Thanks for that, Gary. The siren sounds for the start of the second quarter. The game is back underway. Thump clear. The ball in the hands of Duncan. Duncan just threw it. Chips it towards half forward. He takes the mark. Here's a chance for Elliott. Keeps moving. Rampy collects the loose ball. At full stride, receives the handball. Takes the mark all by himself. With a driving kick. Shield uses the body well. Punches the kick. Stuck the mitts out there and held onto it. 45 metres out. Boat pulls the trigger. Sometimes you just sit back and enjoy the show. He puts through his first goal. He celebrates hard after that. Fremantle cleat GWS Giants. 31 to 6. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. That's a really good team guy. GWS Giants can't getting their hands to the ball in the contest. The modern game is all about winning the hard ball, and they're not doing that today. Back with another set of bounce. Thrashes it. He's got the football now. Ball up in the centre square. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? I'd really love it if these teams took the contest to the next level. Doesn't hold on to the mark. Smith clears the congestion. Ends up turning this ball over. Moved on by Burton. Finding the loose ball was open. Swallow quickly onto the boot. Stringer takes the mark. Kicks along the wing. Out of bounds on the wing. Will get the ball tossed back into play. Ball tossed back in. McAvoy with a big fist on it. Buzzock now heading off to the bench for a break. Well, it'll be a ball up near the boundary line. Swats it. Difficult ball control. Mills unable to lay the tackle. Ainsworth wins the marking contest. Hardigan cuts it off. Links with hands. Takes possession. Just threw the ball. A spearing kick. A good mark out of the circumstances. Goldstein spears the ball. Dacos runs after this one. Dug out the loose ball. Kick by Daniel. Picks it up. Just gets it onto the boot. Picked up by Ainsworth. Uses it by foot. Drops the mark. Gets the loose ball. They can link up now. A long driving kick. Brown controlling the airwaves on this occasion. Fremantle is struggling to maintain the pace of the game. They might need to slow it down and take some uncontested marks to get the game back on their terms. Got boot to ball. Gets into some space to make this. The kick from Duncan. 
A chance to reload the attack now. Sarge sends one up towards the wing. Dacos applying physical pressure. The loose ball picked up. Fantastic pressure there. Couldn't keep the ball in play. Matera coming onto the ground. What can you tell us, Gaz? There's not enough effort out there at the minute. Mops up the loose ball. Goldstein slams it onto the boot. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Now with a low spearing kick. Good mark there. Puts it on the boot. Nice mark under pressure. Fremantle haven't been in control. They've given up way too many uncontested marks and are letting the opposition set the pace. Ainsworth goes by hand. Lynch going for number one. His teammates rush over. The margin is 31. Back in the middle as the Rucks go at it. Goldstein gets onto the ball. Showing control was Jamont. He has the ball. Hands that ball to the opposition. Hartlett handballs. Shield gets a quick kick away. Lynch wins the foot race. And now we'll have a ball up. Punched away. He gets his hands on the footy. Swag unable to hold on. Winning it was Goldstein. The ball knocked out in the tackle. Shield struggling to run at the moment. Not happy with that kick as it goes out on the full. Right, it runs onto the field. Mills elects to kick. Saad runs after the ball. No prior. And the umpire will ball it up. Hammers it. He gains possession. There'll be a ball up close to goal. Clears the contest. Sockers it forward. Ball picked up. Right it rushes with the kick. Control well off the bounce. Moves it by foot. Finding the ball was Rampy. Hartler drops the mark. Manufactures the handball. Wins the race to the ball. This game is slowly slipping away. They must convert here. The Giants still a fair way back here. Fremantle have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into scores. It's why they're still in front. Rampy gets on the end of that handball. Had plenty of the ball. Smith looking to track down the footy. Rushes with the kick. Open opportunity for Marcin. A big contested grab. 25 metres out. He's put that one through. He's enjoying that goal. GWS Giants behind by 24. GWS Giants needs to make the most of their chances inside 50. They aren't getting too many of them. Half-time and a three-mantle. 37 took GWS Giants 13. It's been a promising first half for Fremantle. They'd be confident they can keep it going in the second half. Anything to add? Get the third quarter about to get underway. About to resume play. Punches are clear. Smith with a clean collect. Ball up in the centre square. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? 
I'm waiting for something to change the way this game is going right now. Thompson throws the ball away. Stringer uses it by foot. Takes a simple grab. Moves the ball along the wing. Majek determined to reach the ball. Just dismisses his opponent. Thompson just throws it. Smith gets the opportunity to have a shot for goal. Kicks hurriedly. Goldstein, the number one ranked player on the ground. He's doing everything right. The loose ball scooped up. The free kick going against Ebert. Hartley has a great set of hands. Fremantle, for allowing too many marks inside the opposition 450. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Tips it towards half forward. Grimes shows some physicality. Begley giving away the free kick. Grimes goes with the kick, doing well with the mark. Fremantle haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Brown over the top. Keeps the kick low. Needs a bit of a rest. Begley kicks hurriedly. Dacos takes the mark out contested. Stabs at the kick. Grimes leading the race to the loose ball. Hardigan will be the recipient of the free. Looks to move it by foot. Saar dismisses his opponent with the stay. We'll get a ball up. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? This game needs a spark at the moment. Clears the congestion. Lynch looks to get onto the football. Couldn't get the hand pass away, so he just threw it. Looks up with the kick, and the mark will be paid. Blair moves it now. Nobody can hold on here. Drives it out of the pack. Begley gets on the end of this. 45 metres out. Move it on. He takes the shot. That goal is a cracker. That's his first. They stretch their lead with that effort. Pretty happy with that one. The lead is now 30. Umpire ready to resume play. McAvoy just swats it away. Buzzer controls this one. Rowan wins the ball in the air. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Fremantle forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Buzzer goes for broke. McKay, the better man there. 15 metres out. If they kick this, they give themselves a chance. Congratulated by his teammates. GWS Giants close the gap to 24. Punches are clear. Great control there. Cleanly picked up. Showing some really good pressure there. Jamal gathers it now. Manages to get it out of the boot. Elliott did well not to fumble. Spent that one before he earned it. Finds the loose ball, and the ball rolls over the boundary. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? I'd love for the coach to send a message out there and tell these players to take the game on. Hartler just gets it out of the boot. Smith doesn't want to let his teammates down with this kick. Heads long with that kick. He wins the ball in the air. 35 metres out. Brown takes aim. That kick is missed. Can't make the most of that chance. 
GWS Giants now only trailed by 23. Fremantle have turned the ball over a lot trying to play aggressively. It's where they turn it over which doesn't make it as dangerous. Plays onto himself and he stepped over the boundary line. Shield coming off for a spell. Toss back into play. Punched away. He wins possession. Giving it off was Duncan. Gets it away. Lynch there to mop up. The mark has been taken. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. A time to celebrate. And don't they get around Smith. GWS Giants reduce the margin. Goes by hand to Ryder. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Hammers it. Seedsman uses the bump. Just got the hands in the back there. With quick hands. Has a man running for him. The ball spells the Tira. He gets another possession. Ball collected. Going for goal number one. The contest, no match for him. That's true, huh? 20 metres from home. Go. McKay slams it towards goal. He acknowledges the crowd. That's three in a row for GWS Giants. GWS Giants now only trailed by 11. Is in his possession. McIntosh finds his man on the move. Dug out the loose ball. Nails the goal. Henderson couldn't be happier with that goal. Now they lead by 17. He did really well there and gets the reward. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. Fremantle have been inside 50 less times than the opposition, but they're making the most of their chances, and that sees them in front. About to resume hostilities. Right, it thrashes it. Gets the ball out of heavy traffic. Not long left on the clock now. Plays on now. McKay puts it on the booth. Finds this and marks well. 35 metres out. Should be relatively straightforward from here. GWS Giants close the gap to... And there's the siren to end the third quarter. The scores are Fremantle 49 to GWS Giants 33. Fremantle will be looking to not only hold their lead, but they want to put this beat on doubt early and run away with a big win. Henderson having an impact right now. He's having a fantastic game. One quarter of footy to go. They have to go quickly to have any chance from here. Thumps it clear with the ball now. The ball ends up with Matera. Going for goal number one. A drop punch for the goals. Matera getting the crowd involved. Just under two goals, the difference now. Goldstein thumps it forward. Just put it on the boot. Begley was surrounded. He needed to mark it, and he did. The distance might be just beyond him. They can take the sting right out of the game here. He decides to go for home. Marks now and can send it back. Moves the ball by foot. Right 
Excited. Getting a chance for a break. We'll get a stoppage. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? This is a classic game we're seeing right now. Smith, hurried kick. Ball ends up with the opposition. It'll be a ball up. Thrashes it. This is Smith. Can he put it through? Gets a hand of the ball. Goldstein coming on. Umpire tosses it in. Right it's up to clear. Henderson with a penetrating handball. Kick on the way. He just loved that one. GWS Giants reduced the margin. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. GWS Giants could give themselves plenty of chances. They've got more marks inside 50. It's their finishing skills that's letting them down. The kick releases the pressure. Keeps it alive under some pressure. Slams it under the boot. Picked up now. Using every ounce of energy he has left. Enjoying that goal. Fremantle Clee is now 10. We resume hostilities. Clears the contest. Swallow earns a free kick. Chips it towards half forward. Seen plenty of it. What can you tell us, Gaz? There's some great skills on display right now. It's a great match. Well collected. Goldstein gets it out of congestion. Intercepts the ball very well. Jamont drives the kick. Finds himself in space and marks. Goes by foot. Good mark by the Ebert. He drives it. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. He needs to find a way into this game. Missed the target. Finds his man. Just put it on the boot. Gathers it now. Thump clear. He gains possession. Thank you. Clears the contest. Uses a short handball. Dacos gets the loose ball. Going for goal number two. Sinclair has it. 20 metres from home. Move it on. Going for goal number one. They get around him after that effort. Fremantle, but 16. Centre bounce. Fremantle needs to be more aware of the opposition set up at the stoppage. Their hitouts are getting cut off too easily. Clean from the half volley. Just hits the post and a minor score. GWS Giants keeping themselves in it. A great mark taken there. Burton goes with the kick. Kelly runs after this one. Henderson heading to the bench. And the umpire calls for a stoppage. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of football. Good body work to win the mark. Kicks in heavy traffic over the top of the pack. McAvoy elects to kick. It's marked by Smith. Did well to get a hand in. Scoops up the ball. Elects to kick. 
to Rake. Spills it. I haven't seen him for a while, Gas. He's barely touched the ball lately. Right? Picking it up was Smith. Kicks out of the congestion. Able to release the kick. Releases the handball. Stringer just bangs away at goal. A great goal. Celebrating hard. Just two goals in it. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. GWS Giants are doing a great job of applying pressure and creating turnovers. It's allowing them plenty of opportunities. They just need to convert those into scores. McAvoy got a fist to it. Henderson just put it on the boot. Lee found a way to mark that one. Chose to kick it. Found space for an easy mark. Smith lobs the handball. Here's Buzzer. Duncan wins it back. Takes possession. Is in his possession. Doing well to intercept that kick. Puts boot to ball. Ends up marking uncontested. Just gets a hand in. Rowan clean from the half volley. Wins the race to the ball. Going for goal number one. He's enjoying that goal. The Giants could kick back-to-back -back goals. The slimmest of margins in this. Right in. Won the hit out. Gets around the imagined hit point. It bounces to the advantage of the opposition. Linking by hand. Not sure what the problem is from here, but something is definitely wrong. Springer looking after an enthralling match where every moment mattered. It's celebration time for Remand. Well, Gaz, how did you see that match play out? Teams are made in games like this. I know it can be a moment that takes teams to the next level. They put it all on the line, and they deserve to win. Final scores are 61 to 58. On behalf of Gary Lyon,